Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I just arrived in London. It's really early in the morning. I am pretty jet lagged. I am gonna make myself ready for some meetings. I have to do this very quickly. So it's gonna be a very natural uh, makeup look. I hope you guys are gonna like this video and uh, yeah, follow me along. I just came on a flight and especially for a basic makeup look, um, a moist skin is very important. I'm gonna use this Garland Black Bean Honey Balm. It's for an extra dry skin, which is really great after a flight. You can use this cream um, for body and face actually. And just moisturize the whole skin really well. Also smells like honey kind of. Then for the skin I'm gonna use this Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation and my little sponge and put this all over I'm just gonna keep it like a little bit natural. Next, I'm using this Hydra Bright Concealer by Loon Plus Aster, and I'm gonna cover up these eye bags. There were so many kids on the plane last night, lucky me, so I didn't sleep at all. So this will give some extra coverage Put on the red spots, and I'm just gonna this a little bit what a little bit of concealer can do right and I'm always like tapping it because otherwise the base of the foundation goes away then for my eyebrows I'm using this MAC stylized eyebrow pencil and I'm just Filling in my eyebrows. Then for my eyes, I'm using this Urban Decay Kristen Ling Daydream Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm using this very light color. And I put this on my whole eyelid. I want it to look like that I'm not wearing any makeup, but I kind of do. <laughs> then I'm using this color Daydream and it's kind of like an orangey, taupe, brownish color. And this I put right there in my crease to give my eye a little bit of depth. Getting a little pointier brush and I'm mixing this color with this one and I put a little bit under my eye. Very important, especially if you are a little bit jet lag, the eyelash curler. I'm gonna go back to my skin. I'm using this Tom Ford Shade and Illuminate. This is Intensity 1. I'm just gonna give my face a little bit. Oh, shape. Keep it like super super light. Then I'm gonna tap the highlighter with a 
finger. I just love this palette so much because it's so easy, especially when I travel. It has like the highlighter and the bronzer in one. You can use it for like a day look, a night look. Just depends how much you put on. A little bit here and a little bit on my nose. Then I'm gonna powder my face with Airbrush Flawless Finish by Charlotte Tilbury. This one actually, besides it um, makes your face very matte, it also covers up. Sometimes I just only wear this powder without any foundation and it works also really well. Putting this a little bit on my T-zone, under my eyes, so I will feel awake. And I'm also gonna put some highlighter here to give my eyelids a little bit of shine. There we go. So for my cheeks, I'm gonna use this pretty fresh blush by Charlotte Tilbury again. I just really love her products lately. I'm gonna mix these two a little bit together. Give my cheeks a little color after the line. I'm finished with the skin and I actually forgot my mascara. <laughs> which is actually very important if you want to look like awake. I have a little trick for that. I found this Tarte lipstick in the color Sundays and as you can see it's very bright red and this will take away the attention of my eyes but will go to my lips. This is actually a really good tip. Uh, whenever you are super tired, uh, if you're a hangover or if you're super jet lagged, just pop on a red lipstick and um, the attention will go to your lips and you look very fresh and bright. I'm ready to head out right now. It's kind of like a very natural Chloe makeup look with a good lip to give it a finishing touch. I know I haven't been sharing a lot of makeup uh, routines yet, so if you guys want to see more of this, leave a comment below and let me know. Also, if you like this video, please thumbs up and uh, I hope to see you in my next video soon.